Hi guys, and welcome to Vlogmas Day 8. So today is December 8th, and we are in North Carolina. This is our Airbnb's view during the morning time. It's like 7.20 in the morning. And we woke up early to see the sunrise, but there's no sunrise because it's snowy and cloudy and it's gonna rain all day. Oh, look at that huge at fire. I'm sorry, excuse my language, but I've never seen a fire that big, ever. It's like, it's taller than, it's like taller than six feet. That's absolutely insane to me. Um, but yeah, this is our view. <laughs> Okay guys, so we are getting ready for our first day, our first and only full day <laughs> here in North Carolina. Haha, <laughs> psych, you freaking thought you're going to be there for another couple days. Marley, would you like to tell them what we're doing today? Oh, I don't even know. We have like 12 things to do. One of them could be the Billy Graham Library, mm -hmm. um, like a downtown picture area, mm -hmm. lots of little shops. Something called like, what is it? Like Dona? Domu? Noda. Noda. Domu. Dona? I Donuts? think it stands for like Northern District. Uh, I don't know. Dona? No, Noda. <gasps> There's no Dona. Don no donuts. Donuts! Oh, oh yeah. Donuts! Yeah. There's a donut place that we want to go to. What's it called, Brianna? Duck Donut. Duck Dynasty. <laughs> <laughs> oh my gosh. And it was like 12 minutes from the Billy Graham Library. Wow. So, oh yeah. Perfect. Oh, word up. Word up. A town. <laughs> do, 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 do. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> oh, okay. Oh my goodness. Usher, 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 Usher. Okay. Little John. Oh god, I look so disgusting in this light. Is beautiful. What? So the good. bathroom tour. Look at that. And then look at the toilets. Like what? I feel like I'm in a stable. Amen. Amen. I have to go later.
You gum? You making fun of me? Oh my god, wait. Your hair. Same hair. I know. <laughs> wow. Oh my god, he just winked at me. <gasps> Did he really? He yeah. hates me. He's being so passive. He loved me. Hey, no problem. Wow. <laughs> no, no anger there. I know. I know no, it was Paolo. amazing. It was I amazing. Know. I like little Billy go over there. Oh, he's cute. We'll call him Billy Graham. Okay. Hey. Did he not like you or something? Yes. What's been going on? Hey, baby, it's Steven. I know. Look at those teeth. Oh my god. Oh my god. Hi. Oh my gosh. I can't believe I was face to face with him. Okay, guys. So I know I actually didn't show much of the library itself or like what the experience looks like but if you find yourself in North Carolina please go ahead and check out the Billy Graham library it is an incredible experience and it like really just like warmed my heart and allowed me to remember like the entire purpose behind like being a Christian and like understanding what it truly means to spread the gospel in love and truth which is something that Billy Graham did throughout his entire life so yeah if you don't know much about Billy Graham go ahead and check out his website or like look his name up and I'm pretty sure you'll find a bunch of information about him but pretty much he um just evangelized to a bunch of people and like held huge like not conferences but just like talked like about Jesus and like preached about his word to millions and millions and millions of people and like this entire library and like experience was devoted to him and like learning more about him and everything that he's done um, just to, like, spread the good news, and not only that, but, like, things he's done to help people, and, like, the testimonies that people have brought of, like, the change that his life had on their life. So, yeah, just wanted to put that in, because obviously it was super fun to look at the animals and, like, pet them and, like, look at the mechanical talking cow, but there was so much more within that, and we really had such a great time.
so we just got out of a little place called you can't even see it. Elevation Church! Ah! Thank you, yes. So sorry. Um, and since it was our first time there, we filled out a connection card and we were expecting, I don't know, saying maybe like a pen, magnet, a sticker, magnet, something. I my pen. I did, did too. Um, he was like, we got shirts! Oh my god! Wait, what? It's so cute! How trendy! Wait, it looks like action. It does. <laughs> Just take away the first part. It's That's so, so pretty. cute. So we each got a shirt. And then she said she gave us CDs. I'm, what is it? I need to know. Is it a sermon? <gasps> welcome. It's a welcome CD. Oh, come oh. to the altar. <laughs> Here is in heaven. Oh. I will be confident and there is a cloud. Oh I love my those God. So it's just a little EP thing. <laughs> oh my God. Um, yeah, so I'm really happy. Oh, I because love that. Because that was so sweet. They literally, like other churches can literally give you a pen. Yeah. And a pamphlet. And so pretty much what, let me, story time. <laughs> I'm like laughing so hard because I feel like I just like, what just came out of my mouth? I don't even, I don't even recall saying all those words within the span of one second. So, so I'm on Instagram and I'm just, you know, now, if you guys didn't Instagram know, I am on Instagram. Follow me at Paolo Lusardi. It's actually at Paolo Lusardi. Sorry. Um, but I was just on Instagram. I posted a picture. And I was just looking through my feed. As one does. And then I so was just scrolling through. And my old worship pastor from Miami just recently started working at Elevation um, here in North Carolina. Here is in heaven. Here is in heaven. Mm -hmm. um, and he posted a video of Stephen Furtick speaking and I was like just like a front like selfie hey like, what's up guys this is Stephen Furtick yeah so um I like watched it obviously and he said hey guys so due to the cold weather and the snow it seems like tomorrow's Sunday services will be canceled for all of our campuses and we were planning on going to elevation tomorrow Sunday and it was pr pretty much like the main reason why we came to North Carolina yeah and it was an hour till service and we said, oh, and hopped in the car, literally, like 10 minutes after hearing oh this gosh. news, changed, hopped in the car, and drove here. We missed the first two songs, but it's okay, because today was a special message, um, like, that was just, like, all about giving, giving and changing, like, your focus for this year um, that's coming up, so there was, like, special worship so it was really a great time um True. and god really blessed us with that so yeah right marley seems like she's not even there right marley yes right. she's so <laughs> she's good here. i'm shook actually yeah, she's, she's yeah. actually shook i um, am overwhelmed yeah by the love of god so never ending yeah now we're gonna go to dinner um i just dropped something and i can't tell what it is my lipstick oh god um we're gonna go to dinner and then We'll see where the Lord takes us. But, wow. What a time, guys. What a time to be alive. Um, amazing. Cool. Okay, guys. So, you know how I said we were going to dinner? <laughs> Guess where we are? Tell them, Marley. Goodwill. Oh, yeah. There it is. Good old Goodwill. Always here. <gasps> you see that? That's so cute. I'm going to try this on. I can't get a cart because... I can't keep coming here. Yes, even if it's even. I can't. I can't. Look how cute. Ooh, that's pretty fun. <laughs> Guys. Oh, oh my. <laughs> Come on, girls. We smoke the good stuff. That oh, so smells so good. How are you doing? Yes. Okay guys, me back here with an update because as I said in the last vlog, I have no outros for any of these, so this is the outro. So after dinner, um, dinner was a little bit rocky just because I ordered beef brisket and spoiler alert, I have like really bad like taste associations with any sort of beef that's like braised and I forget that every time I order braised beef and um so I had to like order something else but then by the time it came like I just ordered it to go so I didn't really eat that night 
and I was feeling like not okay because I had so many layers on and I had just been in the same clothes for like seven hours and I was just really overwhelmed um even though it was an amazing day don't get me wrong but after that we went to Walmart because we knew it was gonna snow the next day so we knew we weren't gonna be able to like um leave until so we didn't think we could leave until maybe the next day so Sunday yeah Sunday after church time so like 4 p.m not even then like 12 p.m we thought we were gonna leave North Carolina at like 12 um turns out no that was not the case um and tomorrow's vlog or the next vlog you'll realize why this was not the case um Spoiler alert, we get stuck in snow really bad. Oh, sorry, I'm, I'm popular. Not really. Um, we get stuck in snow really bad, but we didn't know that. So we just went to Walmart to buy, like, cereal for the next morning so that we could, like, have something to eat breakfast for so, so that we could eat breakfast. I'm so illiterate, right? I Incoherent is the word I'm trying to find. So, yeah. We went to Walmart and then we came home and I just pretty much like went to bed almost immediately because I wasn't feeling very well and that's how Vlogmas Day 8 ended which I would say was a success because it was such a great day with so many great memories and probably one of the best days I've had this entire semester. Um, so yeah, Vlogmas Day 8 was a success and I will see you guys tomorrow on Vlogmas Day 9.